Welcome back. We're doing some side quests once again. So where were we partway through here? We needed to get some bitter chocolate and a fruity rice ball. Because we're currently doing, what is it? What was it called? Tranquility. Because we had vests here. We're just getting materials, it seems. I'm assuming this is going to result in us getting a core crystal, which will be vests. But anyway, let's, let's pick this stuff up. Welcome. So, right, so we want... Just get 20 there. Alright, so, we do now want the fruity rice ball in our gentum, so let's see about that. Now, I think I have done, like, develop our gentum, get the moat mission long-awaited work. I think I've done that. I think. So let's go back to our gentum now, then. Go to the market area. Hopefully I've done that. We may have to wait. Long journeys make Tora tired. Refresh and set off again. See, I don't know. But this is the shopping area, so I'd, I don't know. Like, I, did, did I, did I, did I do it? So what was it called? What it was called. So hold on here. Quest log. Tranquility. So. Heard the Merc mission long awaited work. So, long awaited work. It may not be from a shop, but you know, Merc group, long awaited work. Yeah, so it's, it's done. So, fruity, fruity rice contract. It's going to be somewhere then. So, maybe. I've already got it. Yeah, there we go. Just buy loads. Also, you can see I've got my money back up, by the way. I told you I can get my money back up quite easily. Right, so there we go. Tranquility is done. So we want to head back over, I assume, anyway, over to Torogov. That'll be the closest place. I'm assuming that, anyway. I could be completely wrong. But yeah, told you it's easy to get my money back up. Also, I found a lovely way to get loads of um, ether crystals for a poppy swap. Let's rest a spell. Yeah, we're always get getting the um, DLC stuff in the Colosseum and then just turning, like, crystallizing it. Just get loads. Is it here I want to go? Uh, uh, give a bit of chocolate and a fruity rice ball to Mabon in Tretton, Trettle Windmill Plaza. I mean, isn't that here? So do I need to change the time of the day? That's entirely possible. So let's actually look at the map. Yeah, I don't see an exclamation mark. So let's actually go in here, if you actually allow me. So, system, change time. Let's change the time to that. You should be alright then. There we go. Lovely. Jubbly. Here you go. Oh, what a treat. This is exactly the chocolate I was after. Thank you kindly. Could you deliver the rice ball to Vest for me? Da. I'm sure she'll be pleased with it. Um. Oh, give a fruity rice ball to Vest and Tret Windmill Plaza. Oh, God, Ma. Wait, what? Is it, is it the opposite side? I need to cough. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> I hate when that happens. I really do. I hate when that happens. It just gets annoying. So, inside? I've not actually been inside yet. No. Is she up top? Where is she? I see a blue dot on the map. She's not below. She's clearly got to be above. How would I get there? Oh. No. It's just around. It's just around. It's fine. It's fine. I know where I'm going. It's all good. It's all good. Hello! I knew you'd be here. Ah, that brings back memories. I used to eat these all the time. You don't see much of them around these days. But how did you know I like these rice balls? Let Tora explain. Tora has explained. Ah, so Mubbin told you. Let's see what's going on here. He asked you to buy him some chocolate, didn't he? Ah, uh, uh, I knew it. He thought he could fool me, did he? Honestly. I don't know what to do with that man anymore. I have to give him a proper telling off. Oh my. Report back to Mabon. Alright, very well. 
Back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. We gave her the fruity rice ball. She said she'd give you a big telling off later. I still think you made her day, though. Heck, there's no getting past her, is there? I'll have to brace myself then, won't I? <laughs> uh, cough, cough, hack. Hey, are you okay, mister? Cough, cough, splutter. Migo Corvess. Wait, I'll be... I'll be fine. There's no use worrying the lass. I'd appreciate it if you could keep this quiet from her. That you're dying, yeah. Yeah, but... I'm fine, don't you worry. I'm not gonna keel over and kick the bucket just yet. Give it five minutes. That reminds me, what if I... bother you with one more little errand, I suppose. You want us to get some more medicine? Or some medicine? Medicine? No, let's see, it was about 30 years ago now. Back when I was still serving. Me and Vess, we got our hands on a pair of golden braces. Whoa. Yeah, a rare find, isn't it? We were never particularly pressed for money back in those days, so we decided to hide them. I want you to bring them back for me. Okay, can do. Where did you put them? In the fief of... Fight, fife of forgetfulness in Morodain. Thing is, according to Vess. According to Vess? Ah, perfect timing. I was asking Rex here. Would not mind fetching those old braces we buried back in the day? In the fief of forgetfulness, was it? No, no, I think you got them mixed up. It was at the ruins of the Fountain Park in the Kingdom of Oriah, as I recall. Oh, was it? I don't remember burying them there. No, I am positive. It was definitely in Oriah. Hmm. Oh, I don't know anymore. Check both of those places and they'll turn up eventually. Oh, talk about careless. Well, if you can't remember, I guess there's no way around it. We just have to check both of these places out. Or just go to the one Vest said. Okay, look for the golden braces in the Thief of Forgetness in Mormon Ardain. Or look for the golden braces near the ruins of Fountain Park, Oriya. Right, so, let's see, let's go with the Oriya one. Um, where is it though? So that should be good. Just where is the question from there? Let's rest the spell. Oh, Let's get going. A blue exclamation below me. But how far huh. below me? Because I know there's some stairs around here somewhere. It's a question of how do I get down below me? Let's just cheat. Keep missing the cheat. There we go. It's got to be down here then. There we go. Check then. Treasure acquired. We got ba 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 ba. Treasure acquired. Oh, the both. I see. They're both right. That's kind of clever, actually. All right then. So let's see here. So we want to go more ordain. I think it's. There we go. This is the secret place I found. Not so secret anymore, is it? See, how was doing all this exploring? I think it just bounce, nah. bounce around Long everywhere. Journeys make Tora tired. Refresh I don't remember if I can climb that. Again. No. Um, right, let's just check the map. That's not the map. Still getting the menus the wrong way around. Okay, so I see where it is. Over there ish. Ish. Somewhere. There we go. Is it you who has it? Oh no. You're all mine. Just gotta wait for the excavation. Oh! Mind me. You're all mine. There we go. Some lovely little extra bits as well. Right, so let's head back. Do 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 do. Right, so go mate, try to go off, down one, boom, go. Do 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 Let's rest the spell. A spell? Oh, I don't know about doing it for a spell. Shit, oh dear. There we go, Mabon, we found them.
Hey, Mr. Mavon, we found what you were looking for. Oh, you did? Let's have a look. Ah, uh, yes, that's them, all right. It turned out you both right. You find one in Moradena and one in Araya. Is that right? One well, I never. You're good kids for doing all this. You know that? Thank you. Hey, but nothing. Now, there's one last thing I'd like you to do for me. Oh, there's more? Right, so I need you to deliver those braces to my son and daughter. They've each got their own families now, out living in different nations. Fine, I guess we might as well see this through to the end. That's the ticket. Thank you, lass. My son's name is Antis. He should be in Alba Kavanich in Morodain. And my daughter's called Noel. She's living in Fonsamirma in Uriah. I trust you to get the braces to them. And of course, I'll be sure to reward you handsomely when you're done. He's making everyone, like, sure everyone's got, like, their heirlooms and stuff before he dies. That's what it feels like. I keep getting the wrong menus. Fonsamirma. Go... I can still go there. Do 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 Let's rest a spell. I suppose Let's we could rest going. a spell. Okay, so I don't know why I'm wandering around. Ah, so I don't know why I'm wandering around. I could just check the map. It's like are you right in front of me, right here. I've got two blue dots, which could be anything. Aha! No air. Yes, how may I help you? So, this thing is... Fade out, fade in. From Daddy. Oh, gosh. Well, thank you for coming all the way to here to deliver it. Wait, this is a golden bracer. It looks expensive. I'm not sure I can accept this. It's your heirloom. Then again, it is from Daddy. How... How, how are he? And how are... How are... How are he? Jeez. How are he invest doing these days? Best looked after me and my brother for most of my childhood, you know? She's very calm and gentle for a blade. The kindest one I know. Oh, that reminds me here. It's a necklace made from peon stone. If you see Vess, could you please pass it on to her? Torek can handle this without even making fur of Taurus sweaty. I do not doubt it, my fairy friend. Thank you. That's very kind of you. Alright, so off to the next place, which was Moradin. So Moradin... We'll go there, yeah, yeah. Just need the generic middle place, really. Let's rest the spell. Alright, so you're over here somewhere, apparently. Ah, you're up there. There you go. Hello, who are you? So the thing is, it outfit in. Oh, from Daddy. Well, thanks for this. Must have been quite a trek. Oh, braces. I remember hearing about these when I was a kid. Then he invests are still the same old selves, I take it. I haven't seen them in youngs. Don't tell me. Bess is still making her same old dumplings. Me and my sister used to love those. We ought to get all together again sometime. I'd love to see Bess again. Oh, yeah. Could you pass this on to Daddy for me? It's an accessory. I made it myself. He'll probably never use it, but at least it'll remind him how we are. Leave it to me. Thanks a lot. There we go. Right, so back to the windmill we go. It's like, the question is like, when's he going to die? Because that's clearly what's happening. Clearly. It's like, a t it's like, how is no one picking up on this? You should really pick up on this. He's going to die. He's going to die. Whew. Let's rest the spell. Let's not. Let's get going. Time is of the essence. No rest for the wicked. Let's put it like that. You're back. Ah, good to see you. So, how are the bands? They seem to be getting on just fine from what I saw. Make sure to hand over golden braces. Good, good. That's another thing off my mind. How are Antis and Noel? They must have grown quite a bit since I last saw them. They both looked like fine, respectable grown-ups. Oh, yeah. Yes, just give you something in return. Oh, how delightful. Said they'd love to have a reunion sometime, too. Oh, that would be wonderful. I'm getting excited already. Haven't seen them since they got married. How many years has it been now? We really must set a date. Oh, isn't this good news, Mappon? It is indeed. So they're getting on just fine, are they? Though I was worrying over nothing as usual. 
Mr. Mabon's looking very happy. Of course he is. Any of you kids are coming to visit after a long time? Anyone would be. Yeah. Hold on. My belly's starting to rumble. Oh, goodness. Is it that late already? Don't worry. I won't be ten minutes. I'll make enough for everyone. So, what's on the menu today? I'll give you three guesses. Oh, all right. I'll play along. Could it be dumplings? Spot on. You all right there, man? Yes, uh, don't you worry. Just a pesky little cough. She's a sweet lass, isn't she? Totally, and her cooking's top-notch. If making of dumplings is same as cooking. She is perhaps a little misguided at times, but her love and compassion cannot be faulted. Right. My life never amounted to much, to be honest with you. I did some reckless things in my time, all to be the center of attention. And every time I bungled something up, Vess and the kids would suffer for it somehow. But Vess... Uh, she stuck by my side all the same. She took the role of my dearly departed, bless her soul, and started looking after the kids for me. She's become a part of the family now. I don't know what we'd do without her. <coughs> and that's why I just want her to have a good life. Do you know what I'm saying? <coughs> Are you all right? I'm fine. I just need to lie down for a bit. That seems like the best course of action. Let me just close my eyes a moment. My bomb? Oh, that's kind of horrid. Fall asleep? No, I'm afraid he's already. No. Everyone's got to go someday. Even drivers. It's a terrible thing, but that's just the way of the world. Uh, wait, where's Vess? Driver and Blaze are inextricably linked. I expect she will have returned to her core crystal. I'm gonna go and check on her. I'll come with you. I see. It's just the, the fact she just was round here and then like disappeared and became the core crystal is, is horrible. I don't like that. It's true then. She really did go back. It'll happen so suddenly. It must have been a real shock. Are we able to awaken her again? I'll have to wait a while first for the color to return to how it was before. But that mean memories of Mappon are gone going to disappear. I'm afraid so. This is an inevitable part of the cycle. Such is the fate of all blades. But we remember. That right. If Poppy and others still remember, we have power to teach Vess about past. Poppy, sure, she will be more than happy to rediscover old memories. Yeah, you're right. Mabon only wanted the best for Vess. We have to do what we can to make her happy. Oh. It's just, it's, it's horrible. Just, it was just the way she just...
disappeared in the, her, her dumplings, jelly donuts, were on the floor. It's just like, oh, no, that does not feel right at all. At all. Right, so, anyway, we need to do something else now. Um, it starts just put me in such a, like, mm, mood. Just really sort of like, oh. Oh, anyway, in the Libertorium, we need to find some quests here. Because, like I said, I, I, I was told that these quests will disappear. So I need to make sure I do them. No idea if we can get them all done in this part, though. Not sure what we got to do, you see. Meh. Right, Long so where we got quests? Tired. Wrong Refresh menu again. And set off again. Right, so I don't see many of the quests here. I see a quest up there. So I'll go get that one at least. Maybe it's just sometime in this go. chapter. Refresh and set off again. Not 100 percent there. Why is that yellow thing down there? Is there someone painting something? It might be. Oh, it's oh I see. This is a lesson. Lovely. Lovely. Right, you over there. Let's see about this then. Melika. Uh -huh, who are you? Something wrong. Oh, you're not the one of the locals, thank goodness. My name is Melika. My mother was orphaned in the war, and she raised me here in Indol. So, although I'm Gormotti, I've never actually been to, Bo to Gormot. And lately, there's something that's been bothering me. I feel like someone's spying on me all the time. I was accepted into the choir of Indol just recently, and I think that's when it started. You okay? Well, it's driving me a little crazy. That sounds bad, very bad. If you would be so kind, might I ask you to help me identify the culprit? You tore it on job, problem solved in no time. You would? Really? Thank you so much. Um, maybe you could start by asking around among the locals. Just bring me up casually in conversation and see if anyone knows anything. I'm sure the culprit must be someone living in the city. Otherwise, I have no idea why they would. Why they would. Right. I'll be waiting here, so... Please let me know if you find anything. Melika the Cloister? Alright then. Whoa, there's stuff going on all over the place. Dr. To townspeople in Indulsruz Plaza. So, that's got to be the place further down, isn't it? Oh, no, it's, it's here. Okay, so just these little guys all around. Surge. Hey, can I ask you something? Melika? What? I didn't even mention her. What about her? I don't know that much about those fancy choir types. Though I could tell you a bit about the choir itself. Apparently, once you join the choir of Indol, you're basically set for life. I mean, it's an official branch of the Praetorium, so naturally they get special treatment. Those refugees don't get much in the way of opportunity, so lots of folks dream of joining up. Of course, I didn't make it past the audition. My mum and dad were so disappointed. Anyway, that's about all the info I got. Meh. Amazing. Mimi. Alright then, so we'll try you. Oh god, who just jumped in the pool is my question. Please answer the question of Tora. You're looking for info on that choir girl, Melika. Hmm, sorry, but I don't really know a lot about her. Maybe you should try asking that Orion girl, Albina. Albina? She's a refugee and she kept saying she was going to make it into the choir no matter what. But I haven't seen her around lately. What was that? No idea. Oh, it's going to be poppy, isn't it? Uh, not sure what she's up to. That's about all I know, I'm afraid. That makes sense. Thanks. Okay, so we still got other people to ask. I was wondering whether or not it was going to like switch to like, right, now go investigate that. Nope. Other people to ask. No, you're up there. That's just annoying. Huh. Seriously, the music here is just beautiful. Beautiful. Henny. Hey, can I ask you something? You're not like that girl, are you? I guess I can tell you then. There's this girl I've seen spying on Melika a lot lately. There were some nasty looking guys with her too. I tried to get closer and find out what she was up to, but she gave me the slip. Wish I could tell you more, but that's all I've got. Much thanks. Hmm, that's not good. Maybe she's ended up with the wrong sort of crowd sort of thing. Alright, so I'm assuming it's you over there. The one who had- oh no, it's you. Like, who are you then? Like, you loaded in quite early, didn't you? Yes, yes. Becca? Please answer the question of Tora. 
What? You want to know about Malika? She joined the choir of Indle recently, you know? She was the only one in this whole camp who passed the audition. It's really prestigious to be in the choir. Only the very best singers are allowed to join. When you're in the choir, you get to sing at official ceremonies, like when they're moving the titan and stuff. Thanks. Is that all you wanted? See you around then. Hmm. I only seem to be one that was kind of suspicious in all of that. Alright then, so Melika. I'm back. So, um, how did you, your investigation go? So the thing is, so there was an Orion girl in the refugee camp who was trying to get into the choir just like me. Alpina Albina. Can't say I recognize the name, but there was only one spot at the last audition. That's because I passed, she must have... Yep. Mm, could you come with me for a bit? I'd like to meet this Albina and talk to her in person. Are you alright? It'll be alright, I can handle it. Uh, as long as you're with me, I mean. I want to talk this over properly. Come on, let's go. Now? Oh, very well. It's not that... night time already. Oh. Please consider taking a rest. I was going to say it's not that far away, and then it became night time, and the entire quest just disappeared. I'm assuming maybe I need to buy some information here as well. Let's see what we've got here. Poor crystal hunters. Details and look at purchase. Really? Why can't I get that? Hmm. We'll just, we'll just buy all these. Let's just see what's going on there. Hmm. <laughs> right, so we'll change the time of day once again. Because clearly we need to. Go back in time. So where are we at? Somewhere over there, apparently. We apparently ran too far away. We we're closer when we were here with the informant, but... Alright, very well. Um, hello, you're Albina. Melika. I never thought you'd come to me on your own. I was just wondering when the best time would be to go and take you out. T -t take me out? You don't mean you want to kill? Huh? I thought you knew that already. Isn't that why you hire these drivers to protect you? No, these are just some kind people who offer to help. I just wanted to come and talk to you. What's to talk about? If it weren't for you, I would have made it into the choir. I hate you so much, you witch, you pig, you dirty little... Ugh. If it weren't for you, I'd have... Uh, I could just get rid of you. Uh, I could have everything I deserve. I could get out of this hellish life and live like a respectable person. I could give my mum and dad the rest and comfort they need. But finance isn't going to solve any... Oh, but it will. And it's going to change my life for the better. I'm a refugee from Mariah, you know. I know people in the mercenary biz. And once I kill you and join the choir, I'll have the cash to pay them off. Once I explain that they... Once I explain that, they were glad to help. So I'm sorry, but I'm going to have to make all of you disappear. Help, please. Leave it to me. Actually, ended up in a fight. All right, very well. Let's show him a thing or three. Let's get on your side. Maybe we'll get out of this alive after all. My God, Let's try and get stuff built up as nice as possible. Stop hold, lovely. Oh, was that even good? All right, then, very well. Oh, I'm always getting the timing on that run completely wrong. Why not? So is everything dead? I was gonna say, is like, what, are we even targeting anything? No more need for worry. Everything sorted out. We, we lost. What am I going to do now? I have to join the choir. Or I can't. I can't take any more of this life. If it weren't for you, I... I... Albina, I, I don't know what kind of hardships you've been through. But I don't think it's right to join the choir in search of an easy life. Do you think Praetor Am Amalthus uh, would want people to sing at his sacred ceremonies for a reason like that? What are you saying? I'm the one in the wrong here? Yeah. Oh, I get it. 
You think I'm just not good enough to make it in the choir? Yes, that's what I think. Just because you got lucky, you've got some nerve. I... I'm not trying to boast about my own skills, I just think... Go on, say it. Convince me if you think you can. I... I don't think the Choir of Indel exists just to provide wealth to its own members. I think the Choir exists to enrich the hearts of everyone who hears it, its own members included. To join the Choir, you need to be able to wish for the happiness of others and turn those feelings into song. Those feelings are why the songs of the Choir resonate with the people. You can't bring happiness to anyone by singing while thinking only of yourself. That's why I'm... Um, I don't think... I don't know how to say this. And how am I meant to argue with a speech like that? Damn it, Melika. I'm... Sorry. No, no, I'm the one who should be sorry. I really... It really wasn't my place to say all that. No, the stupid thing. I love singing too, I really do. So I guess I'll try again. I'll sing for them. And this time I'll get through to them. Maybe that way I can get the best of both worlds. A happy life and a happy heart. Just, just wait though. One day I'll make everyone see that I'm a better singer than you. <laughs> I guess I should look forward to that then. Everything okay now? Thank you very... You, thank you so much for all your help, everyone. Really no problem for Poppy. Ah, Poppy really growing up. She's so gracious. It was a lot scarier than I ever could have imagined, though. That'll do. But I... I'm glad I managed to make up of Albina in the end. This is for you, as thanks. I hope you'll come and listen to us sing sometime. Melika the Cloister. Lovely. Okay, so the question is, is there any other quests around here at the moment? Straight in with the wrong thing. Can you? Thank you. It's like I don't see any quests down here. I don't see any more in the sanctum. So maybe they open up when I go to the new location. Which is clearly going to be that um, place where the war's brewing, etc. It's like it's clearly I'm heading there. It's going to be another Titan. Yeah, I don't think there's any other quests around right now. We'll, we'll just double check now we've got here. Yeah, I don't see any on the map, so I'm assuming we're actually done for quests for here for now. So I don't know. I'm noticing something over there. There's a shiny thing. It's going to be a knop-on, isn't it? Just a small little thing. Yeah, this is a knop-on. It's a knop-on. It's you. I was wondering what that was. <laughs> it's just, just, just a knop-on. Just a knop-on. Right. I think... Yeah, we, we, we'll, we'll essentially call this done for now. So in the next part, we'll carry on with the story. And then after that, we'll see what's going on with side quests. So we'll try and get the ones done here as soon as possible. But we shall see. And also, remember, do go see about that idea in regards to whether or not I should play um, the Torna DLC after I finish this chapter. Like, there's, there's hopefully, at the, I mean, I'm recording this ahead of time, there's hopefully a little discussion about that in the previous part. So if you're not aware of that, please do go have a look at that and voice your opinions. No spoilers. As to what's coming up, obviously, but just just see if that's a, a good idea or not. But we shall see you in the next part. So, ta-ta for now.